Zayas always has the ability to take someone out of a fight. That could certainly be an opportunity here. So he's going to come down towards the bottom side, try and get a shove in for a potential dive, but they've ran out of minions. And Handshake comes through. All right, so that's battle dancing around. There's the grand entrance, though, and Ona's taking so much damage. He does have the bailout, but it doesn't work. Dwight is going to survive, and Gen G underneath the turret. They have no health, Pace. but T1 are going to go for it. He doesn't even have to flash your Pokey. Oh, Joey, the, the minions, minions they oh. killed him. Oh, Atlas, this is not the start you're looking for. It's but it almost was. It won't really work out. We're going to see what happened in the mid lane, and this looks so close for Pobi. Yeah. See what happens here. Gets hit by the Q. Flash is good. Pobia hits the turret. Oh. Or it gets hit by turret and the minions are aggro to him. And while you have Bio, it doesn't mean anything if you can't start this great quickly. And Genji are already mounting a flank here with the light peanut. You've got to oh, be yeah. faster than this. A lot of crocodiles in this river. It is, I guess, their natural habitat. Habitat kind of makes some sense here. As the Void Seeker going to fly forward, Pace can always turn up as Peanut in position in the back of the pit. There's the flash, the pop blossom, and Gumiushi has to use everything to try and escape.